Virgil, make some sizes for the big boys, okay? Big boys have money. You don't think big boys have money? I would have bought this, but guess what? Doesn't fit the big boy? Guess what? No money for you. I'm Matt Madison with Hypebeast, and I'm gonna shop for some high fashion items. I've always worn band shirts just growing up, going to like hardcore shows and punk shows. And it's just weird, because it's just like vintage will always be the thing. You know, it's kind of, vintage is undefeated. I want stuff to be stretchy, you know? Stretch over the big guy. Shorts, I love shorts. These are like boxing shorts. Who makes these? Main label, these are off-whites. Perfect. 2013 though, Ugh. Don't know if those are cool anymore, you know? Was that like 18 years ago? What's this one? What's this brand? Huron Preston, there we go. Huron Preston. What's the business down here? They got a little crazy. They got a little crazy down here. See, I don't even know anything about fashion. Fashion's so crazy. Like, I could be saying I like this, and then everyone's gonna be like, oh my God, you like that brand. Because I'm like covered in tattoos too, that's such a annoying kind of presence and pattern. So it's just like, I would never want to wear anything too, too loud. See, no disrespect, but you could go get a, a real firefighter jacket at a vintage store, maybe 150 bucks. How much is this? Yeah, $1,700. You go go get 17 jackets. This is like some Vic Mensa stuff. Some of this stuff is crazy. This is what's wrong with fashion. See, why are they putting holes in it? Just go buy a shirt that's old with holes in it. You know, you can get one for like 20 bucks. Like I'll wear a crop top, I'll wear whatever. Like I'll take a shirt and make a crop top. I'll take pants and cut them into short. Like I don't really care. So I've come to this high fashion store because I only like trying on the finest silk shirts. That's not gonna fit me. This waterfall thing is cool. Whoa. That's kind of fresh. Is that kind of fresh? What's this shirt? You know, that old Versace style stuff, but then you got like the photography stuff. That's kind of chill. Let's see if we can get the biggest size they got. I always don't, I don't even, I just ask what's the biggest size they have, you know? I think it's more special just to walk into the store and like always get like, what's the one true piece you want? Everything doesn't have to work. You don't have to wear every brand. You don't have to wear every style. I think it's a combination of like, what really works with you? And I think that more people just need to find what makes them feel comfortable. All right, so I, got, I found some pieces. I'm gonna go try this on and just see how the fit fits, you know? I just gotta see how the big dog's gonna fucking, we're gonna see how this lands. <laughs> okay, so this one we have to be really gentle with. This one's not for the big dogs. The waterfalls are split. Gonna, gotta take it off that way. Virgil, come on, make me, make me, make me, make me custom with the old uh, waterfall, okay, bud? This shirt is, doesn't fit me really. I don't know what this shirt is even doing, but it doesn't fit. Big dog. I could wear this, I would, see, I would wear this just at the beach. Your flower tag matches it. Yeah, so right? Have a complete shirt though. That's right. It's complete. It's, I'm complete. Good. This is good. Like I'm the Canadian Papa Shirt Poo. You have the flowers, you good. I like that. I like that. This is complete right here. I'm complete. You don't even Yo, off top, we're buying two. Like there's moments obviously where I didn't feel comfortable in my own skin. But I think that it's really important to know that like that will pass. I know what lane, I'm in my lane. You know, I'm, I'm me. So all in all, I had one shirt fit me. But you know what? I'm not gonna drop $1,700 on a silk shirt. So you know what? High fashion maybe isn't for me. And that's what's okay. And that's the story that we're learning today. That everything doesn't have to be for you. Everyone has their own lane in every situation, and you know what my lane is? I guess my vintage and wearing old plaids, and uh, you know? Would I have loved that off-white waterfall blouse? I would have, but today was not my day, and that's okay, I gotta just keep trucking. That's it, you know? Hypebeast.